on SMA Watts here and we're about to continue our let's play of the Worgen Warrior in World of Warcraft and we are back in Astranar and we're gonna get the quest from Feldrius Golshell and it'll take us over here to do the Shrine of Asena stuff which is kind of the last thing we need to do before we go to Stardust Spire and into uh, Stone Tail Mountains. The quest that I was mentioned at the end of the video about Rainward Retreat is actually just the quest to go talk to somebody for the PvP zone, and it's literally just, hey, you should go do this this zone. Check in on the Adunes. Margrave, if you have a com moment to spare, I would enlist your aid in a simple matter. I have not heard from my friends, the Adunes, in some time. I was wondering if you could swing west and check in on them. You have my thanks. Their cottage sits on a small plot of land just west of the Shrine of Asina. All right, yeah. And this is the quest for Black Fathom Depths that I'm not going to do, and this is the quest to go to, was it Stardust? Yeah, Stardust, the uh, last part of the zone. Finally, feel organized. <laughs> it's great. I just wish I was a little faster. Not much can be done about that, though. So, Stone Tail and Mountains. Alright, well. We only out leveled it by about seven levels. <laughs> eh. Actually, you know what the narrative flow we're going to follow is now for this character. We're going to go to Stone Helen, and then we'll go to Desolus, into Feralis, into the Thousand Needles, um, and then we'll probably head back up to Felwood. Because Felwood will take us to Winter Spring, and then we never have to go near uh, Sil Sithilus? Is that what it's called? Yeah, Sil Silithus. Because Silithus is still terrible. And that flow takes us with I think we avoid any uh, really bad zones. Hmm. You say that Feldrin sent you? Good man. As it happens, we could use your help. Care to make a quick trip south? I have three friends that I heard from in a haven't heard from in a while. With these strange tentacles popping out of the ground to the north, and all the demonic activity, I don't dare leave my family. Go ahead and set up camp in the southwest corner of the forest, just to the northwest of that damnable fire scar shrine. Aladrin and Hoyt and Harlan joined him, so they should be okay, but you never know. Thanks, Margrave. Did I tell you about that time I explored the far reaches of Dire Mall? With a mighty blue, I slow a murloc, freeing the ore from his cold, slimy hands. That sounds more like dark, sh uh, black fathom depths. Uh, Boyan's camp. Boyan's camp. Things do not look as they should be. Warrior, you must be wary. Kaliva, the foul demoness who has chained us, is nearby. In a bind. Margrave, you must be cautious. Kaliva is still about, and she captured us. She specifically mentioned your name. Only her chain can set us free from. Only her heart can set us free from her chain. But I think it's a trap for you. Good luck, friend. Ah, you've fallen into my trap, Margrave. Right. What was your trap? Didn't bother you dying. 
What brings you? It is good to be free. We must have Kaleva's heart. Disgusting, I know. But if we three are to be free, it's not enough that she's dead. We must eat of her fell heart. Till next we meet. I am honored. An end must be put to the burning legion's evil. Margrave, you have defeated one of their most powerful, but there is still multitudes of demons infesting the woods to the east in Firescar Shrine. As a friend of the forest, will you slay these foul creatures and warn Big Babu, the great ancient of war at the Shrine of Asina to the northwest? East? Goddess yeah, sure. Victoria. I don't know what I did to get that big six-armed chick's attention, but her plan wasn't very good. Mwahaha. I got you. Get him is not the best plan. Like, it's never worked for me. It's never been like, no, nah, that was a good plan. It's always been like, that was not a plan. Um, I seem to be behind somebody, but I'll take the medium leather. Hopefully they don't massacre the entire population. I'll eventually find some demons to kill. Yeah, see, they're just, uh, Level 20 Warlock. If I was anything but a warrior, I'd give them a buff, but warriors don't buff. We sometimes yell, and if you're near us and an ally, our yelling might make you feel better, but... A lesser fell guard. Yeah, I don't think that Torrin's gonna fail. Well, he might. Not flat for PvP, though. Not that I would jump him just because he attacked the rare. I'd consider it. And Fell Slayers. I remember when these things looked neat. And I was like, that is just a badass looking pet to have. It was like back in vanilla. I wonder if they're going to do an overhaul on like the monsters, like all the models are getting an overhaul when they, uh, in Warlords. <laughs> It'd be funny if it's like, well, like all the player character races models are updated, but ogres still look like butt. They've got to, they've got to update the ogre model. I mean, ogres are part of the whole Iron Horde thing. At least I assume they are. And again, the th image doesn't show like Chogal. Hmm. Though I'm thinking about it, Chogal might not actually have been from Draenor. I think Ch um, he might be a recruit to the Horde when they're in Azeroth. So that may, that might mean there are no ogres, even though ogres are f 
from Draenor, sort of. Ogres are very confusing. Because there are definitely ogres on Draenor. And there are definitely ogres that are native to Azeroth. And that's like the only race, I think, that's native to both. But I'm not actually sure if any of the clans of the Horde before the Tides of Darkness were ogre-led. Because, I mean, obviously in Orcs versus Humans, there was just Orcs and Humans. We add Elves and Dwarves and Goblins and Gnomes and all that in Warcraft 2. Still, Ogres should get a new character model, because Ogres do exist on Draenor, we are going to fight them, and they look like butt. And ultimately, the, the they look like butt part is kind of the most important. He seems to be having a bit of a row there, isn't he? A fine job, my little Morgan friend, but as you can see, I'm a little busy here. Margrave, I desperately need your help. I cannot hold out forever against this demonic onslaught. If I fail, I'll strain ours next. Please help me. against this demonic onslaught though. You've saved us, Margrave. I have the power to finish off the, flat, the final few. No longer will the forest have to fear the Burning Legion. The savior of the forest. Were it not for your actions, Australia and the rest of Ashenvale surely would have fallen to the Burning Legion. I hope that this day finds you well, Margrave. All right, well, that'll do it for this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope to join me in the next when we head to Stardust, whatever it is, in the south, and finish off Ashenvale.